form that said Snuffles, and he's uh -huh. like, "Is this like you? Is or it's like someone just messing around?" And I was like, "That's not me." Dang. And uh, I guess he's a real player named Snuffles. I, I thought it was like Dan or someone that put me in bracket. I I didn't know, but nope. There is a that's there's, how you... there's Snoople and Snuffles here. Let's go. Plays a spacey too. <laughs> Plays a spacey. I used to play that guy a little bit, a cool. little bit more. A little bit. We got a spacey match here. Wolf versus Falco versus Oil. Oil or Grizzly? Or, Grizzly uses tag. Oh, Grizzly uses tag. Grizzly. All right, bro. All right, so <laughs> we got shots already. Game one. I feel like all spacey versus spacey matchups are like sort of weird. Um, I don't really know like what a, a Falco matchup chart would look like. I saw eclipses, but like he said himself, like, oh, you might think I'm like delusional on some of these. So maybe he's a, a Falco enthusiast. He did say this matchup was even though. So. I can believe it. Take that I mean, for what you will. You know, all, all spaces are really volatile, you know? Yeah, exactly. They exactly. all have, you know, weaknesses off stage, but, like, really good combo potential on stage, so... You know, they can both mess each other up. Ooh. Up yeah. the angle downwards there. Oh. I feel like volatile could be, like, one of those words that's sort of, like, overused on commentary, but, like, oh, I feel like sure. it applies to a play safe space so hard, you know? Oh, so They're, true, like, though. all glass cannons. Yeah. The next up beyond stage is gonna get met with a mean forward smash from Grizzly. Uh-oh. Snopple's not opting for the Ignite headphones. That's actually, I really like uh, the, the up tilts coming from Falco and Neutral. Oh, That's yeah. like, it's just such a good move. It's such a good, like, anti air. So good at, like, catching, like, let's say Wolf wants, like, approaching Parrish. So good at catching moves like that. For sure. And then it combos into itself and these up airs. Yeah, very good move. Falco people, combo game's really good. Oh, for sure. It's, like, kind of underrated, low key. Because people are always like, oh, Falco, he's so bad, but he's definitely no, I got think Falco, yeah. Falco's pretty good. I think if he had, um, like in this game, you, if you back air out of shield, it doesn't like hit them usually because it usually goes too high. Yeah, I think if he had like Smash 4 back air out of shield, he'd be so good. Oh, true, yeah. His Smash 4 back, back air was like instant. Yeah, because he can have like a frame 4 insane out of shield option. For sure. Oh, catches another up tilt. Ooh. That blaster spot dodge battles. That's the classic. When yeah. you like spot dodge something and then they spot dodge your like <laughs> attempt to punish it. Uh oh. And then you both like roll away or something. Or yep. like continue grabbing or <laughs> yeah. something oh. stupid. Nice spaghetti. Uh oh. And yeah, Grizzly running with. This is looking like really close at the start, but yeah. Yeah, these unsafe like. Ooh. That's oh, wow. Well, not the greatest DI on that, but like yeah. that was a. That was kind of a hot combo. I'm not gonna lie. A little was, bit, yeah. I don't even know like. What went wrong there? Because at the beginning it was looking like pretty promising. For sure. And then I, he just like recovered unsafely, like on stage, and just got F smash super early. Yeah, he was just kind of like getting up tilted. For in, sure. In at like those low percents. He was like not respecting Falco's up tilt enough. Yeah. That's a move like you just gotta like Falco's will throw it out because it's such a good move, but like I don't know. You gotta you gotta realize that you can't just land on that move. Like if, if Falco hits that, he's gonna like get a combo and then some. Like oh, definitely. I feel bad because you can see me on my phone and the, in the I was, camera. <laughs> I was looking at that right now. I'm, it's okay. He's tweeting the stream link. He's not. He's not texting anyone. We have focused commentators here. For sure, unrivaled, unrivaled tour tournaments. Is that it? Yeah, you got it. You All got right, it. I'm, only, I'm only gonna say that because we're professional. <laughs> we're professional. All right. So what stage do you take him to? I definitely need Yoshi story. Yoshi story. All right, bet. Down laser. Oh, ooh, ooh. the comeback. Adaptation. <laughs> For real. Snopple's saying, not today. <laughs> yeah, he has the download. It's, it's actually over. <laughs> For sure. Uh oh. The worst is like when I'm fighting a Ness or something, and I like laser them, and then they just bat the laser back. It's like, oh, yeah, you got me. You, you got, got me, me yeah. so hard, and everyone <laughs> <For> saw it. <laughs> True. Uh-oh. It's like you played yourself. Uh-oh. Snopple looking pretty good here. For sure. These guys are just scrapping. Uh-oh. Nice nair out of shield from Snuffles there. Uh oh, good down tilt. <gasps> what? Okay. It like that was yeah weird weird yeah, interaction. Right, it had like a reverse hitbox there, and it was close because had he gotten the strong hitbox, Falco would have been exploded. Uh oh. Wow, weird weird hitbox of up tilt there. Oh, but finding the nice hitbox there. I think yeah. the short hop kind of messed him up there. This is like sort of where where Snuffles downfall. Like oh nice there for sure. But we saw the uh, we saw like the up tilt cast there just on an aggressive approach. So, but he's Ooh. been doing a much better job of avoiding those this game. He's been like in advantage for most of it, getting yeah getting him off stage, getting him in the air for sure. And then taking his first stock of the set here. Shot him up. Shot him up. <laughs> Oh my goodness, he is all over him this time. The retaliation. Hey, I know you were joking when you said, you know, the download is... No, actually. Complete, but, oh my man, God. he is 
just the reverse, exact opposite situation we yeah, saw from game one. Yeah. <laughs> now Snoffles. Except this is like more dominant, honestly. Yeah, yeah low key. I mean, like, yeah, it might, it might not be a three stock still, but that's, we'll see. I don't know, man. It'd be fire if we got the three stock. <laughs> yeah, no, the reverse three stock. That, here. that like, yeah. Then game three would have to be last hit. Like, yeah. it just, that's just how the prophecy has to unfold. Oh, for sure. Uh oh. Okay, good fair shield. Good nair. Nice. Catch it. Wolf snare lasting so long. It's such a big hitbox. Yeah, uh -oh. like if you're ever unsure about what your fair will connect into, it'll probably connect into nair. So True. Safe, safe thing to go for. Finding the up air. Finding the back air. That could have been a strong hit. Oh, he tried to end it all there. He wants the prophecy to come true today. That's gonna do it. Yeah. All right, no three stock, but JV opportunity. JV opportunity, yes. But Falco, you know, he's got a laser and an up tilt. Lost the JV opportunity. Yep. But of course, this is looking grim for Grizzly. Uh oh. But nothing's impossible. He hasn't been hit in a few moments, a good few moments. So let's see if Snuffles can just close it out. Ooh. That's me. All right. Finding it's, the back. It's so hard to play the comeback game against Wolf because like he'll just like he racks up damage so like easily, and then he has so many like safe moves that kill like relatively early percent. For sure. Plus, you know, he has Blaster to just annoy you. And yeah, rack up damage. Mm -hmm. Like F tilt will kill, Nair will kill, back air will kill extremely early. Like, right. Yeah. Up air will kill, back throw will eventually kill. Up tilt kill. will kill. Up tilt will kill. Don't even yeah. Don't even get me started on a smash attack. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. Yeah. Man, so this is a good set, a very competitive set here. Mm, yeah, this is. This has been an entertaining one for sure. For sure, they are just scrapping back and forth. Probably both. Yeah, know, assuming we'll. See. Yeah. For sure. All right, so we'll see how this game three pans out because mm. there was so momentum based. Like whoever got the first stock just ran away with it, you know. Yeah, and I think like game one was on Battlefield, and this was on Yoshi's. This is not even like the the stages were that different. Yeah, exactly. Oh, running it back to Battlefield. Oh man. Oh, there is no DSR today. <laughs> okay. Oh. And yeah, here Grizzly starting off, starting off stronger there. Uh huh. Uh oh. Finding okay. these also combos we were talking about. Caught his jump. Oof. Really good by Snuffle to uh, after game one. Like after he got bodied for it, he hasn't really recovered with the upbeat on stage anymore. Yeah. He's been going to ledge pretty much every time. Not even like side being on stage. He's having like really really safe recoveries. Since then, it's just a really good. Ooh, I like that. Jumped up with the shine. Oh, I love the lingering there into the grab. Good air dodge from Grizzly getting out of there, finding his up tilt. That was some pretty good coverage from Snuffles right there. He just missed base that fair at the end. Oh, for sure, yep. And this is an even game here. Oh no, dropped his shield at the last second. They yeah, recovered with the side B on stage. Yep. Fighting the raw dash attack. Yeah, not gonna mess with that up tilt, not gonna try to punish it. For sure. Sometimes it's better Ooh, to you nice. know. Nice. And this is dangerous. Oh. Oh no. Ooh. Took a turn for the worst thing. Yeah, for sure. It looked like he tried to like tech it, but you know, the fire just barely sizzled him up. Yeah, I like the back air off stage. Like I like going for the edge yard. Right, for sure. Especially in a spot like when he's in the he's in the firebird. And that one it's probably called firebird. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, that unsafe side we're gonna get him punished here. Gets the nair. <gasps> that, oh, okay. that worked yeah. out. Okay, yeah, that was so risky because as we know. Yeah, no, I was, I was thinking that too. Like, I, I like the the back air on the firebird he did earlier, but like, I feel like there you can sort of sit at ledge, try to like F tilt that. Uh, right, F tilt, that phantasm. Or, or even down smash. Because yeah, the phantasm, you know, Falco's will send you straight down. So had he been a little and more careless, I, yeah, I, he might have used his double jump too. Like, I, I don't know. So. Well, anyways, so, it worked out. Yeah, so. he's alive. He, but at 83 here, 94 after that. His blaster got shot right back yeah, at him. The ultimate no you. Uh oh. Fair conversion. All right. Ooh, I love it. Reacting oh, man, he's really all over well right now. Yep, exactly. He's reacting to where Grizzly is rolling. He's gonna recover low. I like that. Uh oh. <gasps> no. Nice air dodge for sure, and no two stock lead no matter what happens anymore. So. A lot more competitive. The prophecy is looking to hold true. This will be last eye last hit if it continues at this rate. Not the best EI and fair, but yeah, oh. I think he used a double jump there too. Yeah, exactly. So I think he thought he had it. Dead. Yeah, I think he thought. Like I think he tried to double jump side B, but man, just lost it in the chaos of that combo. Yeah, right here is where the game's determined too. Like if if Grizzly just runs away with the lead, like right here, 
Oh it, it's so hard to bring it back. Sometimes. You're right, and but, I'm so sorry. I've been saying Grizzly the whole time, like the bear. It is just Grizzly. Oh my goodness. I I'm, wasn't. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I'm so sorry. Sorry, <laughs> sorry Grizzly, if you're watching this back, man. I apologize for that one. But anyways, Grizzly anyway, yeah. taking the lead. You know, at 105 though, finding the Nair. I mean, the Nair is a good. It, it just like it might just feel riskier than it is because like <gasps> that Nair lingers so long. Right. Yeah. He's going really deep for these back airs and stuff though. For sure, he feels like he has to. Oh man, so much shield damage on that. Yeah, that was good like, adaptation from Grizzly though because he realized that he was trying to do those uh, those yep. like side beats on stage. For sure. But unfortunately, missing the punish. They both just signed at the same time. So, wow. For sure, they both said, "Try it." Yeah, I, I dare, dare you. you. <laughs> yep. Double dog dare you. Uh oh. Oh man, opting for the back Drawing air. Drawing him off stage. <gasps> oh, he tried to catch him with that dash attack. Sneaky, sneaky. Uh oh. So close. Ah. The no oh no. Yeah. There were a few like situations sort of like that where he was like, he just sort of SD'd. I don't know. Yeah. He was like using his double jump pretty aggressive off stage for a lot of the set, but yeah. For sure. Man, well, hey. That was stuff. still an entertaining set. It, no, was, it was super entertaining, yeah. Yeah, it was three stock, then like dominating two stock, mm -hmm. and then. Oh, basically last hit. Yeah, basically last, last stock. Yeah, last stock. Anticlimactic, but yeah, yeah, good stuff to Grizzly for, you know. Yeah, that's not the way you want to end the set, but.